Matt Massacre, Matt Kustos, whatever your name is now, shut up. Now, seriously, you issued this little promo on me saying how I suck, saying that all these little things that shouldn't even matter coming out of your mouth, I mean, why would you change your name to Matt Massacre? Come on now, you should be proud of your name. Don't call yourself a little massacre because you doing that makes a massacre out of yourself and not others. You're a joke by changing your name. You know what would be an even bigger joke than that? If I were to change my name to Sean Seeley and sell sleep number mattresses or change my name to Ron Relby. That is a prime example of how big of a mistake you made by changing your name. I could have came up with something just as ridiculous, but I didn't because I'm proud of my name. You shouldn't call yourself a massacre, because you're a massacre in yourself. But the point I'm trying to make here, Mr. Massacre, is that I do accept your challenge. And uh, at Wrestling in Wisconsin, there is Wrestling in Wisconsin. I don't even think there is anymore. But that's not the point. The point is, I am going to so-called destroy you, murder you, kill you. Whatever you want to say you were going to do to me, I'm going to actually do to you instead. Because it's really simple, Massacre. We wrestled once before at CCW's Forsaken something when I was there in July of last year. Now, I beat you, fair and square. The match wasn't the prettiest in the world. In fact, it was pretty sloppy. But point being, I've gotten better and you've gotten better. Let's see who the real man is. And since I don't know how to change my name to something stupid, I'm sure I'm the better man. And the fact of the matter is, I will be the better man. I am the GBYWN World Pure Championship. Champion. Now, uh, a lot of people say I don't deserve this belt because the only reason why I won is because of Mike Creston disqualifying himself. I think it was a strategic move by bringing a chair to the ring, make him think I was going to get myself disqualified, and make him angry so he could choke me out. That was the plan, and it was perfectly executed. I am now your champion of the world of the pure division. Now, I was told, Mr. Massacre, by you, that you want me to name a stipulation. Well, considering I am still so damn dandy, the dandiest man on the planet, I am going to make this challenge very simple. There's one weapon that made the name Dandy Dan so famous around here in Wisconsin, and so hated. That was the man who brought his own damn chairs. So what I'm issuing to you, Mr. Massacre, is that we have a little uh, bring your own damn chairs match, BYODC man, and we'll kill the fuck out of each other. And do you know why? Because I believe that you are a nobody, and I will destroy you. And you know what? You said something about, uh, hmm, gain momentum off me for whatever super show you're going to next? No. I'm here to prove myself that I am the next big thing in backyard wrestling within the next couple of years. I have the potential. I have the power. I have what it takes. And now at RCW There's Wrestling Wisconsin, when I have the home field advantage, I'm going to cash in on those things I listed. I'll prove to you that I'm not a loser, I'm not a failure, and that I sure as hell am the future.